What is going on everybody? My name is Mr. Cap guys and welcome to Mr. Cap TV. Welcome to a brand new video. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. My day's been pretty good as well. Today guys, I've I have been extremely, extremely sick. Um my voice, you guys can tell that my voice is kind of different. I, you probably hear a lot of you know a little bit of coughing in this video and a little bit of sniffing in this video, so I do apologize for the video that I couldn't bring up yesterday. But today guys I thought it would be a double upload today and then there'll be a video tomorrow, um and then and so forth. So today guys this this video isn't gonna be like extremely long. I just wanted to bring something to you guys. I know I'm a little bit late on this topic, but th this came up in the Call of Duty community a couple days ago, and it's known as Call of Duty 2016. Now, a lot of people want to know what the next Call of Duty is, myself included, you know. No one really knows what it could be, but there is some names that usually comes and rises to the surface um, for people to, you know, talk about. And the first one was Call of Duty Bloodlines, and that was something that everybody was like, okay, this could be the next Call of Duty. Would Could this be awesome? Like, what? I wouldn't want to call it the bloodlines. It sounds sick. It's gonna be by Infinity Ward. I made a video a couple days ago known as "Could Call of Duty Ghost Be the Next Call of Duty?" And when I ta when I said this, I never knew about these two new topics, these two new names. It never brought up to me. No one ever talked about it um, until after I made the video. But I did notice in the video I said that Call of Duty Ghost Two could be a uh, a could be the next Call of Duty or a new genre of a Call of Duty, a complete new Call of Duty. Um, you know, genre. Now, if you guys haven't seen the video, I want you guys to go check that out first because you know, talk about that a little bit more. But the next one is Call of Duty Bloodlines. Now, it's by Infinity Ward that has called, this next Call of Duty has been confirmed by Infinity Ward. And so, would we want a, a Call of Duty Bloodlines? Yeah, I would want a Call of Duty Bloodlines. Anything that's on the ground, anything that's awesome. And then something else got brought up to the world and to everyone else known as Call of Duty Space Warfare. And it is, it is half. You know, it takes place in a space kind of world that people talked about. I've seen this article right here. I'll read it to you guys on screen right here. It says, This year's Call of Duty, the, the Ghost and Modern Warfare developer Infinity Ward is working on, will apparently be set in the future even farther than what we've seen in Advanced Warfare and Black Ops in the Black Ops series. The information was firstly mentioned by Shinobi602, an industry source that with a proven track record, so a proven track record, Shinobi was replying to another Neo GAF user when he revealed the details. The same has since been independently confirmed by Eurogamer. If you guys don't know what Eurogamer is, it's a big event that's hosted um, to, you know, like kind of like VidCon, but like it's for gaming and it, hosts, it shows you like the new game is supposed to come out and stuff. Confirming the game will include space combat between wiring sci-fi groups. It will also naturally not be a direct sequel to 2013's Ghost, so it would not be one. Activision recently confirmed that gameplay from the title will debut at E3 this year, but did not speak as to when the game itself will be officially revealed. So, the Ghost 2 will completely be um, thought out. I didn't know, I, I didn't actually know this, but it will be completely thought out. Like, we know goes to um, but there will be something known as something like space. So people just talk about space warfare, it in the space world, and something that's kind of different. And we know that we know that you know, we had future stuff. We started future, a little bit future with Ghost. Then we jumped into Advanced Warfare. It's completely out of the water. You know, exosuits. Then Black Ops. You know, Black Ops Three toned it down a little bit and jumped it up to kind of a different base. You know, with the their movement system. And then now we're going into Space Warfare, which is something that's completely different. So could we have a Space Warfare? I don't know. It's not really confirmed. A lot of people are talking about it. It's been you know brought up to the surface. Um, you know, in Shinobi, that that energy source. That, I mean, the energy source that main provider source is the one that has a proven track record so th could this be the next call of duty we don't know it's supposed to be coming to e3 this year um now so we don't know guys so it's gonna be really really awesome to see what the next call of duty is and i just thought i would tell you guys and bring this up to you guys if you guys didn't know about it most of you guys probably did but i just want to tell you guys if you guys didn't know about it now i want you guys to know leave me in the comment section would you guys want a space warfare uh kind of t based COD 2016, or would you guys like to keep it on the ground based? And also, something else people have been talking about is that the space part is supposed to, you know, contribute to the campaign, but not bleed into the multiplayer. So the multiplayer is completely different um, from the, like, the multiplayer is supposed to be on the ground, and then the campaign is supposed to be in space. We don't know what's going to, you know, what's going to come to that, because mostly some things that come from the campaign go into the multiplayer. So we don't really know what's going to happen um, from Infinity War, but they have 
three years to do this game, and whatever they do, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be awesome. So, like I said, guys, leave in the comment section would you guys want the next Call of Duty to be space space or to be on the ground? If you guys did enjoy the video, I'll smack the button below. I'll be doing a lot more content pretty soon, guys, and I'll see you guys tomorrow on some more content. Peace out, everybody.